and if you want to join in this month's giveaway this is the prize this is a custom made one of a kind indie projects notebook morning everyone hope you're all well what are you up to today we've got David coming around from cruising the cut to do a podcast um, so I've given the bow a bit of a tidy everything's looking nice nice and neat there's the mic set up that we're gonna have you're probably all looking at that and thinking yeah it doesn't look nice and neat for us this is neat obviously in a small space it instantly looks cluttered the moment you put one thing out of place so for us this is really tidy and ace. <laughs> Hello vlog! <laughs> wow, this is awesome! So, David, do you want to introduce yourself? Yes, I'm David Johns and I go by the name Cruising the Cut on YouTube and I live aboard my narrowboat and I vlog about my time living aboard. Yeah, so David has kindly agreed to come and do a podcast with us today. We'll put a link to his uh, channel in the description below and we'll let you all know when the podcast comes out as well. Not for a while, but we will let you know when it does come out. Uh, so thanks for coming, David. <laughs> I made a good cup of tea, so that's really nice. It was a really good... Got it here. If you're ever popping around a Theo and B's, seriously get a cup of tea, really nice. <laughs> and I don't even drink tea, so that's really nice to know that I'm capable of making good tea. <laughs> So I've decided that we're all going to uh, enter a massive sugar coma during the podcast. Do you well, want a treat? I, I, I'm, I'm going to say no because otherwise I'll be all... <gasps> Offended! No, no I'm joking. Oh, I'm going to eat them later. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to eat the whole lot later. But... Do you want one now? Uh, no, I'm going to... Uh, Everyone is yeah, turning my David's treats advice. down. If I start with that between my teeth... I'm going to do of... it. It went great. It was so good to have him round to the boat and just have a raw chat about everything narrow boats and vans as well so yeah i think it's going to be really good so keep an eye out for the cruise in the cut on our podcast it's going to be good when do you reckon it'll be out uh i don't know we need to kind of figure out a way to schedule them but hopefully within the next month i'm really looking forward to our podcast coming out because it just it adds another element to uh everything that we do we listen to podcasts all the time when we're driving because obviously you can't watch telly when you drive <laughs> and a podcast is just a nice way to absorb information listen to new topics and stuff um whilst you're doing something else like i tend to listen to them whilst i'm running or whilst we're driving and stuff or sometimes just lying in bed i love podcasts so it's really exciting to be doing them and hopefully you guys will like them too and it was lovely to see david he's always a pleasure to to meet up with so it was great Time to get editing. <laughs> Lots to get through. Hi! <laughs> so it's a film off. It's a film off! <laughs> <laughs> so Ellie and Scott have dropped in on their way to Wales to get a telly office that we don't use anymore that's just down here. Yeah. So it's got a remote as well, so you can literally just lie down and not even move. <laughs> Is that a naked you? It's it a is. naked Theo. Yeah. I've seen that picture. Before. That's how I've you now. It's on Instagram. It's on Instagram. It's private. We've never posted anywhere else. <laughs> <laughs> the new GoPro. I think yeah. So. Is it yeah. It's old now. Isn't it? What's this thing? It this big five? circular what thing. What it is is the the GoPro there. The murder. Do you have to to have an external mic? You have mm. to have their own breakout box. That's pretty cool though. That oh, you can you have can, an external yeah, mic on a GoPro. Well. Yeah, so you can put filters on it, and um, it's got the uh, the hot shoe. It's like really pimping out a GoPro. It's cool. Yeah. It's nice. What? It's voice activated. Yeah. Should yeah. Do. GoPro start recording. That is that is mental. It never does it. Really. <laughs> GoPro it doesn't like recording. you. <laughs> GoPro start recording. GoPro. You
Let's start recording. <laughs> GoPro, just ignore me. GoPro, start recording. You just turn that. <laughs> <laughs> so Ellie and Scott are actually going to do. You doing a vlog of your yeah. travels? So our first little vlog. Because everyone loves them in our van tour video, understandably, because you are so nice. <laughs> so you should definitely check out their channel for their vlog that they're going to be doing. Because no doubt it will be ace. Good morning, everybody. Um, I filmed the first bit whilst it was still far too early in the morning, and I like just reviewed it, and it looked awful. <laughs> We're just on our way to Wales, back to Wales, South Wales this time, Rosalie Beach. Apologies if I have pronounced that totally wrong. We're meeting up with a couple who have recently moved into a van. They converted an old ambulance and it looks absolutely amazing. Uh, Theo's just coming back now, we're about an hour away, so time to continue on the road. Oi! Oh. Feeling relieved. Deja vu. I know. <laughs> I've had to refilm it because the one of the other one was so overblown. It was too early to film. Right, let's go. We're about an hour and a quarter away. Weather's looking really bad, but. It's not heavy rain though. Well, it's yeah, spitting. it's not really heavy rain, so what I'd have to do is film the tour from the inside and then when it dries up or if it's kind of misty rain, just go out and grab the shots that I can of the outside but you just have to work with what you got don't you so looking forward to it still though let's go We made it. It's very dull. <laughs> Inquisitive. <laughs> yeah, we're here. The land of Wales again. She loves other people's vans. Yeah. Yeah. It's really interesting, isn't it? Yeah. Are you picking up change off the street? Yeah, I'm cruising around slightly bold. So we are at Rosalie Bay. We've met up with uh, Project Rambo the Ambo. <laughs> you can probably see the red one behind me. I'm just walking Gingy Poo. Uh, and I'm getting lots of funny looks, but this is what happens when you walk a cat. Uh, she's doing really well, actually. She's getting more and more used to being on a lead, which is cool. Um, oh. Ollie kept calling the cat Winston. <laughs> So is your van called Rambo? Rambo the Ambo. <laughs> Sound better in New Zealand accent. Wonder <laughs> if. If you get my pelly case, I can stand on the pelly case outside. Perfect. I'm nearing the end, just getting the last shots now. <laughs> yep, talking to myself. <laughs> I was like, you don't see me, you see It's about five o'clock now, I think. Um, Oh hey Ginge, Theo's just doing the last few parts, hopefully it's not too dark in here. Uh, and it's gone really well, um, it's a lovely van, Sam has done an amazing job. I think you will all absolutely love what she's done. I didn't want to show too much and give too much away because, you know, you've got to have a reason to tune into the van tours. We've literally got up, got up at half five today. Just haven't really eaten enough today. I've only had one coffee, like what earth's going on there. 
Um, I'm just I'm going to sleep really well tonight, and I'm really waffling right now. I'm sorry, but yeah. So the van's a bit of a mess. We literally got up and left. So here's mine, and Theo's going to be getting this. What flavour is that? I don't even know, but I know they're not the healthiest thing, but they're quick and easy. Um, and we've just got, as usual, batteries charging on the go. Um, that's still charging. This one's getting close. So these are for the screen that he uses. This is for the camera. And then, yeah, so they're just charging through there. And it's all just a bit of a mess, but when we do pull up tonight, because we're not going to stay here, when we do pull up tonight, I will then get the van nice and tidy and cosy, and we've got two days before we meet anyone else, so we're going to have two days to just do our own thing. Gingy's gone for a little stroll, haven't you, baby? You've been out loads today. That is a really cool van. Super cool. Maybe we should get an ambulance. Yeah. The roof rack is amazing. <laughs> uh, Try and do it now. So we just wrapped up on another van tour. Really cool ambulance. Really excited to get editing that one. Super nice couple as well. Everybody we meet is so nice. They are. It's so good. Yeah. And uh, yeah, they let me spend the whole day with them filming the van tour. And I'd have just headed home, but... Yeah, we need to find somewhere to stay for the night. Yeah, I'm knackered. I we're in Wales. Asleep. Did we mention we're in Wales? <laughs> yeah. We're in Wales. Wales again. again. <laughs> we're now leaving Rossley Beach, uh, heading into Pembrokeshire. We've got a uh, destination in mind thanks to the lovely Hannah, aka Slightly Salty. I sent her a message because uh, she knows some places there, so we're heading to somewhere where she recommended. If I can get my maps to load and we can leave here, at the moment it's very foggy. I don't even know if we're gonna leave this beach, god damn it. I'm so tired, I feel like, I feel like I've never been this tired in my life. I don't know why, I haven't done anything today. Theo's done all the hard work. <laughs> and now he's driving, so uh, let's see where we end up. Hopefully at supermarkets so we can get some food because I didn't have a chance to buy anything. We've got hardly anything, nothing appealing, nothing that I want to eat anyway, except a small kiwi, so let's see what we can do. Leo's pointing at things, I don't know what. Mist. Mist. Yeah, this is the mist. This is what we're battling against, people. Can we escape? Only time will tell. We have found a uh, superstore Tesco and I have bought bay beans with veggie sausages in, which is just the most exciting thing ever. This is my highlight of 2017. Uh, and now we are heading, actually, we're not going to Pembrokeshire today, we're going to try and wild camp in Mumbles. Uh, Theo's got a car park in mind that he's been to before, so let's see whether it's good or not. Not a bad view for the night. Not a bad view for the night? It's going to be dark, you won't be able to see anything, mate. Well, not a bad view right now. I'm knackered. <laughs> <laughs> I've forgotten how to talk. But yeah, we've come to Mumbles. It's really not that far from where we were. And the weather's cleared up a little bit, so B's gonna make some tea and then we can uh yeah, watch the sun fade. Or the light fade. Yeah, because I think the sun's actually set now. Yeah, the sunset. Watch the light fade and just relax. Probably get an early night. And maybe even a lion as well. Oh I don't think we're gonna get a lion in the car park where we're we're no. part tonight, so. Because where we are will be quiet tonight, but there's a restaurant like right there. So whilst the view is lovely, even though it's now getting dark, this is clearly an area where saddos like to come and hang out in cars that have really loud engines. <laughs> there's a lot of people just driving past in their funny little pimped out cars. Here we go. Surely there's something better to do, like go to the cinema. Anywhere you go in the UK, coastal, kids with souped up cars. I don't get it myself, but as long as they're happy. Better than doing drugs. 
Good morning everybody, hope you are good today. First things first today, I'd like to do a shout out to our Patreon supporters who chose the shout out in the vlog option. If you want to have a shout out in our vlog, then check out our Patreon because you can have one. Um, so yeah, Anna Gregory, Susan Gregory and Tamas Langley, thank you so much for supporting us on Patreon, it really means a lot to us. And talking about Patreon, we actually have a giveaway on there every single month. Um, you can join for only a dollar. And if you want to join in this month's giveaway, this is the prize. This is a custom made, one of a kind, Indie Projects notebook. Perfect for travel. I kept a diary the whole time. Oh, I keep a diary all the time. A6 in size so it fits perfectly in your handbag it's got a handy little thing to keep it shut this is hard with one hand and it's lined and there's tons of pages so you can keep track of all your adventures so yeah if you want to win this it's a different prize every month on our patreon this is this month's one we'll send it to you uh, wherever in the world you are we won't charge you for postage because obviously it's a giveaway so yeah join our patreon from one dollar a month and you could win this this month next month will be something else it's different every single month so yeah check it out it's great talking about other things I'm waiting for Theo so I can cook this baked beans with veggie sausages he's gone for a little walk somewhere I went for a walk as well we stayed in Mumbles last night um, it was actually fairly decent as you saw in the last clip we <laughs> we pulled over in a spot that was actually quite crap we thought it'd be good because there wasn't a through road or anything like that it was a car park that was a dead end so we went towards the end and it was just obviously the spot where everyone in their boy racers just like to hang out at night so it was really loud and there was lots of cars it was not chilling so we went further down the road because we'd spotted another car park overlooking the sea that was a lot quieter we went there the only people we saw here were fishermen and someone getting up to some dodgy intimate act in their van uh, but anyway enough about that <laughs> it's a new day we're in Wales and we're gonna probably start heading north um, I've never been to this part of Wales before South Wales so it's really nice to experience mumbles and stuff I've been for a walk already it's a lovely day and uh, I'm just waiting for Thea so I can have some breakfast because I'm absolutely famished but for now it's coffee time thank you so much for watching please subscribe now and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video if you want to support us and help continue making our videos then join us on Patreon from only $1 a month see you on the next one